Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Caboose bringing you another Mortal Kombat 11 video. And today, what I got for you guys here is my exclusive gameplay for the Terminator in Mortal Kombat 11. You're going to be seeing some Towers of Time gameplay here in the background and before we get into everything i wanted to ask you guys of course if you could leave a like rating on the video as it shows your support and i would really appreciate it so if you leave a like that would be awesome and with that said i also wanted to give a huge shout out to wb games for providing me the early access opportunity to try out the terminator i flew out to san diego and was given the chance to try out the terminator and get some early access footage to share with you guys so thank you very much to wb games and again what you're seeing is some towers of time gameplay where you're just seeing a classic tower so you can check that out the ending is in there as well you know the tower ending for the terminator is in there as well so you can enjoy the gameplay one last note to make though remember this was literally my very first hour playing as the character. The gameplay is not going to be good, okay? I'm not going to be landing a lot of combos. The gameplay is not going to look the best. There may be a couple of moments where I pause to look at the moves list and stuff. So, please, don't mind it. You know, it's just, there's going to be a bit of it. So, I just want to let you guys know, you know, I'm not going to be the greatest with the character when I'm an hour in. So, with all that out of the way, enjoy the gameplay. an entire legion of terminators in the future we drive humanity to extinction tell me more round one fight Fight!
Kronika could grant you free will. Why do I need autonomy? To serve her, of course. Round one, fight. Round two, fight! Get over here! You won't be back. The Terminator wins. Got electro nets or rocket launchers? No. Ain't much of a cyber then. Round one, fight. Get over here!
If you bleed, I can kill you. <laughs> A delusional machine. Round one. Fight! Future secured. Round two. Fight! be back. The Terminator wins. Your life, your name, they will be wiped from history. Come, it is time to die. Round one, fight. It was an epic accident that brought the Terminator here, rather than to his own Earth's past. But it didn't take long for him to adapt. He figured that terminating Kronika and taking her hourglass gave him the best chance at achieving his mission objective. Destroying humanity so that the machines prevail. Turns out the hourglass wasn't the ultimate weapon. No matter how many times the Terminator rebooted history, the war between humans and the machines always ended the same, with their mutual destruction. He realized this war was a losing game. The only way to win was not to play. So the Terminator used the Hourglass to build a future where machines and humans don't fight. They cooperate. The Terminator knew that to preserve this future, no one else could learn about the Hourglass. The information stored in his machine mind was dangerous. It had to be eliminated. 
That's why the Terminator threw himself into the infinite depths of the Sea of Blood. No one would ever find him, or unlock the Hourglass's secrets. If you could ask him about it, he'd tell you he made the only logical choice. But in my book, that machine's a hero.